I love it. So I've been making green juice for three years now and after three years I can claim that I've mastered it and I discovered the best green juice ever. It is the best and you're just gonna have to trust me because in three years I went through a lot of struggle drinking things that don't taste very good but this one is the best. So I am going to start with my first ingredient. So this is for two juices. So the first thing I'm going to juice is my kale. So I have two leaves of kale. You can definitely use spinach if you would like to. It tastes just as good if you don't like kale. A lot of people don't and a lot of people, uh, their uh, digestive tract disagrees with kale. So you can use spinach. That's fine. The second ingredient, it's about 20 stacks of parsley. So about 20 stacks of parsley and we're going to stack it in. And while we're here, I'm also adding four stacks of fresh mint. Mint is the best. I think mint is the, the secret ingredient in this juice. So I'll add my mint stacks as well. And, and you need about one third of a cucumber. So this is English cucumber. That would be one third of the cucumber. If you use the other, the smaller cucumbers would be about half a cucumber. All right, let's have some fun. So here I have four celery sticks. We uh, crunch them in half, stack them in, and now I'm gonna turn the hardness all the way up to five. Let's go. So the next step is a bit of work, but it's totally worth it because all that pulp that is inside the juicer actually contains a lot more juice. I am going to take the pulp out of, out of here as much as I can and I'll run it all one more time. Oh, that pulp smells like uh, mint, it's so nice. And then whatever is left over, I'm gonna put in my compost. Go right back where it came from. Feed my veggies outside in the garden. All right, that's good enough. And we'll run it one more time. You can see how much more juice is coming out. Okay, and we're done with the juicer. And I'm gonna move the juicer so you can see the last steps. So here, and another trick with the juicer. Once you're done juicing, you leave the whole juicer up. You see that? It's quite a bit of green juice left there as well. It's, it's a great juice, trust me. I wouldn't drink as healthy as something might be. If I don't like it, I wouldn't drink it. And uh, as I said, I went through a lot of uh, struggle drinking all sorts of things, green things, but this one, it is amazing. So the last thing I'm going to add, the last thing I'm going to add, it's one orange about this size, one lemon about this size, and one grapefruit. And my grapefruits this year were quite small. So if you're using a regular size big grapefruit, I would say use maybe half or a quarter of it. So I'm gonna squeeze the juice out of those. And again, I can't stress enough the fact that if I don't like something, I, first of all, I'm not gonna recommend it on my channel. I never post recipes or things that I don't like myself. And I'll tell you how I ended up with the recipe. It's not like I came up with it on my own. But one day I was at Costco and I saw green juice there. And I basically, I bought some, I loved it. And I read the label, what's in the ingredients. So I tried, kind of sort of tried to match it up the best I can. And I think I did a really good job. So I'm gonna mix all the ingredients together. And one crucial thing with green juice is it doesn't taste great when it's room temperature. So I like to add ice. So I have my ice and over here I also have a bottle because usually I cannot drink the whole thing. That's a lot of juice. So usually I have some of it and then I pour the rest of it in a bottle. I can refrigerate this one for up to 24 hours. It still tastes good. And I am going to try this one. Look at the color, look at the richness. It is, it is absolutely beautiful and it tastes amazing. That is fantastic. That is really, really good. I love it. You have to try it, guys. It is really good. So I hope you enjoyed this juice. I hope you try it. It's super healthy. And if you like this video, give it a thumbs up. Subscribe to my channel. Thank you for watching, guys. I'll see you next time. Bye. Oh, and share this video with everybody that hesitates to have green juice because that tastes nothing like kale or parsley. You can just feel the citrus and the mint. All right, I'll see you next time. Bye.